everyone and welcome to another playthrough of Space Hulk Ascension from 2014. We're here at the third and what will be the last uh, campaign of this game. Considering that they, they lost the rights to the to selling it, there is no more uh, um, a bit, uh, availability to uh, buy the um, DLC, which means that we cannot play as the uh, Imperial Fist to play at the Shield of Retribu Retribution. We can't play as the Dark Angels in the Bringer of Sorrow, and we can't be play as the Salamanders in the Forge of Heroes. But now we're going to be playing as the Space Wolf, which I've heard is what some of the the, the hardest type of uh, Space Marines to play in this game. And they got the Fall of Jotunheim, which is destroy or redirect the Space of Jotunheim to, and discover the fate of a long lost Space Wolf pack. Over. Fall of Jotunheim. Space Wolves are a rare sight and it's rare still that the warp spits them out in an inhabited system where the deadly alien cargo can threaten the citizens of the Imperium. The vessel's codename Jotunheim is one of such space hulk, is such a, one such space hulk. It has appeared in the Aethan system and usually it is transmitting a message on all frequencies. It is an ancient dialect of Fenris, home world of the space wolves. My brothers are redeemed, Jotunheim is no longer a threat, so says Herald of the Rout. Rout is what you call the old, really old way of saying uh, the, the chapter or the legion back in during the, before, during the Great Crusade. So this means that this is a really, really old space marine. Your force of Wolfguard has been dispatched to border with Jotunheim, end whatever threat lies aboard it and discover Herald's fate. So we're gonna find Herald. We have two squads here. Of course, as always, the first one we're gonna change into Jari. Because I prefer playing with the... Um, uh, with the... Uh, what do you call it? Oh, he only has three abilities. Uh, Uh, the, um, the librarian usually has one perk over the other, so that's why I want to continue with that. So let's see if we can get more points later on. So we're gonna have reduced heat, the heavy flamer, heat at double rates. Uh, well, it doesn't really it doesn't really give us that much to hit this time around. Can see appearance head. Oh, they can have those head. All right, he's gonna have that one. He's gonna have that one, and he's gonna have this one. This one. They're all close, close combat here. That's very interesting. So we're gonna make them a little bit less personalized. So Squad Jari is going to be our primary squad that we're going to play here in the campaign. Uh, squad Gisels, I believe, will be the one that we're going to play in the spin-off missions. Because you know that you, have, you always have to replay the campaign at least once to get to play all the, the maps. Is what I've learned from the previous uh, playthrough. Alright, alright. I feel ready now. Let's go in here. Uh, the Purge. Advance for the enemy, kill as many uh, of them as you can. Exit with three or more terminates. Alright, so this is gonna be one of those where you on the run. Entering through an old wound in the Jutemheim's flank, your squad advances into the dark maze of twisted metal and broken debris that is the interior of the Space Hulk. You are following in the footsteps of Herolf and other heroes of legend, eager to forge your own saga in these ancient corridors. You are the vanguard, charged with preparing the way for the main assault by clearing areas around the breach of whatever alien filth has made its, has made its home here. Bring them death. Sergeant of the squad, accept your orders. Alright, so it's not too far we need to go. However, they are newbies, so that's not gonna be fun. So, uh, spin around. So, having played through quite recently the Blood Angels campaign, uh, it's very strange returning back to basics once again. Uh, Waiting. Oh, oh, you have actually new voice lines. I did not expect that. Uh, we 
we're gonna keep that for now. Let's see, we're gonna get you here. In position. So we want to get up there. So I think the best route is go up here, I believe. That's gonna be the, our best chances. Move up one. Terminator ready. Terminator ready. I so hate, uh, I hate the enemy will fall before me. having so Don't few action points to use, uh, uh, so you have to take it really slow. That's one thing I don't miss from the first game, is that, uh, uh, that uh, you're, you, you can actually upgrade your troops a little Moving bit. Out. Hopefully we can get him up to using the, um, the shield a little better. The Space Wolves are a very strange breed in that they don't really like uh, Psykers. Oh, well, nobody likes Psykers, but they in particular hate them. Terrible aim as well. Well, we need to get move on, or otherwise we're never gonna get out of here. I think I will have to play through the one of the other campaigns no mercy. in between this just to level up my troopers a little bit. Otherwise, we're never gonna get out of this. By your will, my lord. As I said, they have different voice actors. It's uh, very unnerving. So we're not gonna go up there. He, he might have been a little bit off there, actually. Let's see, can you use anything fun? Oh, well, maybe we can save him a little bit. So the big bad space marines, uh, big bad yeast stealers can't get to him. Securing position. Ready and holding. Ready and holding. Speak, speak much slower. Beware. Oh, Jesus. Wait, they, these are Kraken uh, gene stealers. Oh, he's gonna get killed. He's so gonna get killed now. We have contact. Come on, go and save him, please. I am moving very slowly. Ready and holding. Ready and holding. I wonder if we should uh, move with the guy down at the bottom too. Do you have an aim fire? Flank secured. Ready and holding. Initiating attack. Oh, he killed the librarian. All right, uh, make a run for it. Yes, brother. Moving. Rush. Authority. Oh, <laughs> that's embarrassing. Uh, so you lost the um, lost the librarian in the first attack. round. Rush it. No mercy. All right, brother Vogger, you will hold them off for as long as possible. Something tells me that they don't seem to be able to run that far. That's good. OK, 
Okay, the others are in some sort of safety at least. I have movement, brothers. We're not gonna wait for our brother. If he dies, then he dies. Yes, my lord. I have movement, brothers. Before us. Alright, escape now. Flamer, do your thing. If he lives, he lives. It's so embarrassing that we, that we lost our librarian on the first game. Entering. By a filthy yin stealer. Well, this is the day he dies, something tells me. Very embarrassing to play through. So our ne next uh, librarian is now Vulpen and uh, we're going to continue his story for this <laughs> campaign. Well that's everything for today, a very short mission but thank you much for watching this, see you around everybody, bye bye.